Hey, we're back again, and this time we're going to be putting together a, using the lean dough, we're going to put a savory one together using cheese and herbs. So I'm going to show you how to do that, and I'm going to make it a little bit fancy. I think you'll enjoy this one. Okay, so I have this rolled out into my rectangle, and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to just put some cheese and some other kinds of stuff on it, um, because I like, bread is, we can always do some savory. So I'm, um, I'm going to go ahead and put some, this is mozzarella, so I'm going to put some mozzarella cheese, you can put cheddar cheese, you can do whatever kind you want. I'm going to get a little bit fancy and put some Monterey Jack. Um, I just, my th I'm one of those people that is like, if cheese is good, more cheese is better. And then I'm going to put some Parmesan cheese over the top of that. And I'm going to make this sort of Italian, but again, you can put any kind of um, cheese that you want and put any kind of uh, seasonings you want. I'm gonna, because I did mozzarella and Parmesan, I'm actually going to then sprinkle with a little bit of spices. So I have some Parmesan, I mean, excuse me, I have some basil and I have some oregano. You could put garlic on here. Um, you can do other kinds of seasonings as you want. And I'm just gonna roll this up. So what I'm gonna do is, like I said, just make this into a roll. And so I'm just gonna roll this into a nice long roll here. And then I'm going to pinch the edges close so that I can do this like that. Okay. And then I am going to um, actually put this together on as a ring. And I'm going to make it just a nice big savory ring. So I have my I have my uh, pan here, and I'm just going to make this into a circle. And then I'm going to go ahead and cut about once every itch so that I can make it so that it's going to be, like I said, a cheesy kind of loaf. If I wanted to, I could just put it in a loaf pan, allow it to rise, and it would have just be a cheese-filled loaf. Um, I'm just doing it this way because I think it's fun and sort of fancy. And then I'm just going to turn this open so that I've got these so you can actually see them. And I'm just turning them sideways so I just like laying this down and just putting it so I'm hoping it will be nice and cheesy and sort of almost like have a cheese um, skirt which is what they call it when it gets nice and um, uh, crusty and sort of stuck that's why I definitely want to make sure that I have it either on parchment or I want to have this one on a well greased sheet because the cheese is going to sort of stick and get brown and crusty I'm going to stick some extra cheese in some of these that look a little bit low and um, so that's what my loaf looks like here and I'll show you what it looks like in a few minutes.